Hello everyone, Sort Rider here. Um, as you can see, I'm in a very empty room. Well, it looks empty from that angle, but if I turn around this, you can see. Oh, about 50% of my collection has now been pass uh, packed away. Just a couple of dudes up there I need to pack away. I'm a bit relieved it's all over, to be honest with you. Um, the packing, that is, because literally it's taken me a good... A good eight evenings after work, as well as a couple of weekends to get to this state. I've also sorted out the majority of my loft, and I found a few cool things up there, which was pretty good. Um, but I'm just excited now about trying to get this move complete. Hopefully the sale of this house should go through at some point next week. And hopefully, I'm hoping the week after TFN is the week that we'll be able to move into the new house. Now, it's still going to be a while before I put um, all my stuff back on display. But at least I haven't got to worry about losing pieces and I've wrapped everything in bubble wrap and I've, I've put all the weapons in little bags and I've repacked all my masterpieces into their original boxes as well as my third parties. So I'll be happy when this move is over. Now, the purpose of this video today is a video response to uh, Tony or Soundwave SG1. He asked, what are you getting signed this year? Uh, I know the TFYTC have done some similar questions, um, but I feel I've already answered some of those in my previous TF Nation videos this year, so I thought I'd just do a response to Tony. Um, so, let's fly through some of this stuff then. So I've got a pile of bits and bobs I want to try and get signed. So, I've got my Last Stand of the Wreckers book. I really wanted to get that signed last year, and I forgot to take it with me. So, Mr Roche and... Uh, Mr. Roberts and Guido, Guido Guide. I'm really terrible at pronouncing names. I'm so sorry, but those people are going to sign that for me, which will be fantastic. Uh, I've got a comic here. Who? Uh, who's this going to be signed by? Josh Perez. Get that signed by him, which will be brilliant. Um, I've got the best of Transformers. I thought I'd get that signed by Simon Furman. I've already got his signature, but I thought that'd be a quite cool thing to keep. Um, Mr. Bob Budiansky is there, the the brainchild behind the characters of the of the thing we know and love. So I've got a couple of things I want to get signed by him, um, and I'm not going to do this all in one go. Uh, I'm going to take the advice given by Tony and other people. I'm going to get maybe one or two things signed on the Saturday and some things signed on the Sunday, or at least go round in a circle and let some other people join the back of the queue if I want another thing signed. But I've got a couple of comics. I've got that one. Which has actually got a double cover on. Um, I only noticed it when I took it out of the package. So, yeah, so I'm going to get that signed. Got another comic here with Runner Book and Runabout on the front, which is pretty cool. I have these in a frame um, when I move into the new house. Now, this is something, and Tony, you suggested this, so fair play. What a great idea this was. My Transformers Universe book from when I was a kid. It's a little bit battered and got a big crease down the front of it as you can see there but it's something i've held on to for years and years and years so absolutely i will be getting that signed well, i've got another comment by guido 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 there we are i'll try and say it right this time or how megatron get that one signed i've got a megatron origin origins book i wouldn't mind getting signed uh who's this one by i forget uh, this is Alex Mill, so I'll hopefully I'll get that signed by Alex. Um, I have my DVD to get signed by the guy who did Shrapnel's voice. Um, and I forget which diner, but, but basically I've got the DVD, which I'm going to get signed. I'm going to try and get this signed by as many G1 characters um, as I can. Um, and I know, I think Tony's got the same one as this as well. And also, I found these when I was sorting through um, some of the DVDs when I was packing. And I thought that might be quite cool to get signed by him as well. Um, the other thing I really want to get signed uh, is um, Wilness's book. Um, I really... If you haven't got this yet, uh, it's Robots, Pancakes and Comics. It's a fantastic read. Uh, it's got some great recipes in there as well. I mean, it, oh, sexy pancakes. I mean, oh, this man this man is an absolute legend in the kitchen, I swear to God. And his Christmas dinner is phenomenal. 
He also talks about how eating pancakes with a spoon as opposed to a fork actually enhances the flavour of the pancake. And I'm an absolute sucker for gimmicks and little novelty things, so look what happens when you open the cover. So, um, the other point was, are you going to be picking up any third party? I'm open to, yes. Um, I think I'm very interested in the IDW Star Megatron. I might even pre-order that in advance of going. Um, what else am I interested in third party wise? I don't know really. I, th I think what I want to do is, uh, having never experienced a Sunday before, there are some third party figures I'm actually quite interested in, but I don't want to pay the full price for. So it'd be interesting what has been discounted on the second day and i'm absolutely going to keep a, a couple of hundred quid in my back pocket for the sunday just for that purpose really just for bargains um but that megatron looks pretty pretty cool um it's not far away now is it uh we're talking what three weeks on friday is that right or is it two weeks on friday three weeks on friday it'll be. i really really can't wait i really really can't wait to to get there now and to walk into the de uh, the dealer room for the first time, to walk into the hotel the first time with James. I'm really, really excited about it. I've got a bag already. In here, I've got my swaps and um, things I'm taking to for people. So, for example, I've got a whole lot of Star Trek books for uh, a Samway of SG-1. I've got the Orange Fallen for the Collector 75. I've got... Um, some Star Wars stuff for Dave Shotton. I've got um, Steelbone for Dave Shotton. I've also got uh, Wheeljack for Johnny. Um, yeah, so I've, I'm getting a bit organised because I'm conscious there is a risk. There is a risk that I move house um, before TFN. And if that happens, I really want to make sure that the stuff that I've promised to people... Like this, Dave, um, is actually in one place, so we we'll know where it is. And those books um, that I'll be taking to get signed are also in there. Um, anyway, really quick video today. Uh, I have picked up a Voyager last night Megatron, which I plan to do a review on. Um, but as you can see, I won't be able to do many psychic comparisons as half my collection is packed away. Well, the majority of my collection is packed away. I've been Zort Rider, and I'll speak to you again soon.